Hello, I'm Matt, and welcome to Matt Plays Resident Evil Revelations 2. So this just came out today. Uh, I had it on my wish list for a long time, but I didn't. I never committed to it, and mainly because I never played the first Revelations actually, and so I wasn't sure if I wanted to play this one or not. And I had it on my wish list, didn't commit to it, and then it released. It launched today, and I saw that you could actually buy just the first episode for. Six dollars, I think. So, I bought it, installed it, and we're ready to go. All right. Good. Yeah. So the theme is uh, a continue. Um, Continuation. I don't know if it's actually a continuation, but it follows the naming of uh, the Revelations, the first Revelations game, which I never played, but people said it was very good. So, I don't know. I guess we'll see. Let's uh, just do normal. I'm a normal kind of guy. I usually play normal the first time I play a game. The world lives with it. You live with it. Viruses are stolen, re-engineered, misused with tragic results. And who are you supposed to trust? Politicians who sell their souls for a few votes? CEOs who betray consumers for a quick buck? Count on us instead. We're above the politics. Always watching, always ready to face the threat head on. We are the unflinching mob that sops up the evils of bioterrorism and chemical warfare. <laughs> Dynasty. Or Dallas, I should. Which one was it? Terror save. Because terror doesn't have to end with the risk. All right. Hey guys. How'd you feel? Oh, hi Claire. Claire. Hey. Hey Claire. Moira. Welcome to the club. Uh, reporting for duty, Ms. Redfield. When do the hazing start? <sighs> Cut it out. We've been friends for how long? Long enough that I'm allowed to give you shit. Claire, did you, uh... What's up, Neil? Something's going down in Washington. Did you hear anything? What, the new virus? Come on. You know Tricell's history, right? Hello? Hey, that's Barry Burton's girl? Yep, Moira started today. But you've got to be careful if you're going to mention her, her and her dad. Oh yeah, emotional minefield. <laughs> okay. You did your homework. What other horrible invasions of privacy have you gotten there? Hey, I got to look out for Terrace. We have our enemies. Anyway, good luck breaking her in. <sighs> She's not a horse. Bye. Uh-oh. What do you do this time? Fucking Barry. Every time I ask him anything, he pushes back. I wouldn't even be here if I listened to
So, boy, uh, Boyra, Barry's daughter, Moira, Barry, everybody's favorite character from Resident <laughs> Evil, I think. Well, mine's always been Jill, but even so, Barry's very popular, with good reason, Barry's awesome. And, uh, his daughter apparently is involved in this. What? Where okay. Been taken? Something weird about this, though. Um, the aspect ratio seems really out of whack. I don't know if we can change it. Options, crap. Yeah, screen resolution. Okay. There we go. Much better. <laughs> it looked really grainy and bad earlier when I had it on the resolution. I don't know why it was on that low resolution, though. It's bizarre. Anyway. Oh, shiny. What the hell? Oh, shit, there she is. Hey! I'm gonna get you out of there right now. Moira, are you okay? Did they hurt you? Oh, I mean, hey, hey, hey. I mean, what in a moist fiddle of fun is What in a moist barrel of fun? It's okay. We're gonna get out of here. Uh oh. Okay. What did we do? I wish I could tell you. One thing. One thing that uh, I think is funny about games in general, so I guess nowadays, what do you think this place was? is that really there's ooh, there's been an interesting surge of a certain type of genre, which is. Jump, which is the you know strong protagonist with a young girl sidekick. <laughs> you know, which there was two of them in 2013: The Bioshock Infinite and The Last of Us. And now that's sort of become a thing. Now, um, I guess technically Walking Dead, the Telltale games, they did it first. That came out first, right? Before? I think it did. Um, but uh, it's been it's interesting how it's sort of been become a Genre unto itself, and now Revelations 2 is doing it. So it's kind of, kind of amusing. What the hell? Did you hear that? Did you hear that? Yeah, I sure did. Open here. Ooh, that's uh, special. Just wonder if I should plug in my controller for this. I'm using my mouse and keyboard right now. I don't even know if this controller support. Let's see anything over here. Oh, I'll take a good look at that Claire model. She looks pretty good. She's looking good. I love Claire. Here we go. F. Nice. This will come in handy. Guess I'm on light duty. <laughs> Actually. I think later, I mean, yeah. I think later you can actually play as Moira, so that's pretty. That's pretty cool. Where are we going? In here? Ooh, oh what the fuck? Hmm. <laughs> uh, interesting. 
an auto save, I can get him. Uh, participating in experiments, must be following rules, subjects must be monitored 24 hours a day, monitor the sensor for any changes, log its status in 10 minutes, dispose of any subject, showing signs of abnormal imme abnormality immediately. <coughs> Excuse me. I just had a bunch of egg rolls <laughs> for breakfast. <laughs> I was gonna have cereal, but then I saw those egg rolls that I had in the freezer, and I was like, yeah, you know what? Let's have a bunch of egg rolls for breakfast. Will we open that? No. 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 Yeah. One of the... I never like blinking lights. Anywhere. In real, real life or games or movies. We can squeeze under this. Give me a hand, Moira. <laughs> Oh, we're playing this morning now, I guess. Or are we not? I don't know. Come on. Get in there. Now Capcom has said Whoa. Stand back. That they want um Revelations to they want this game to be more like the Resident Evil of old. Whoa! Oh no, get him! <laughs> oh my. Why are we going this way though? Yeah, they want this game to be more like the Resident Evil of old. And, uh, we'll see if that's the case. Um, it seems like to Capcom that means putting blood on the floors. <laughs> oh my. Well, let's go help. I wanted to help her, man. I need a gun, dude. What the... Break. Hey, here's a. Here's something. Do we need it? I don't know. Um. Oh, okay. You can use it in game. Gotcha. So, RE6 style. And five, right? Did you do that in five? I don't remember. I hated five so much that I don't even really care. Oh my. Uh, get in there. Where did they go? Where did they go? Oh, I got turned around. There we go. Mm -hmm. Oh. She, uh. She's a zombie. Oh, or not. Little eyes. Oh, God. Did you know her? Apparently, I did. Yeah. She's with Tara Save. Why would anyone do this? This is not cool. I can hear the wind out there. This must be the way out. So we need to find a way through. Damn it. Can we open? No, it's not a lock. I thought that was a locker. <laughs> okay. There we go. What kind of whack job was oh, this? is not okay. Yeah. You got that right. Electronic lock. Does this guy have the key? Here. All steady. Uh, okay. Almost got it. Oh no! Of course. Well, that blows. The door just unlocked. Or did it? Yeah, it did. 
All right. What's that noise? I don't like it. Okay. Where did the key? Get turned around again. Uh, locked in the side. Okay. Don't like this at all. Uh, let's see. Got some papers. Hey! A ruby. I should check the other ones. Are there any more? Any more desks? Uh, no. Okay, there's the key. Alright, we made it. He's okay. Well, you know something's gonna happen. I can tell that something is about to happen. Because then probably that thing will stand up. Is that you? Where's Keith? Keith. The key's gone. What? Hey, there we go. You, uh, you gonna use that? It's more reliable than in person. If you say so. I love Claire, man. She's like. One of my favorite Resident Evil characters. The key must have shook loose when the body fell. It could be anywhere. It's too dark to see. Shine the light around. Oh, we can switch. Oh, okay, good. What the fuck? Did it fall in the... Don't like this. You think it might have snagged on something on the way down? Ah, right there. Claire, I see the key. It's out of reach. Let me try shooting it down. That's a waste of ammo. Boom! Oh, no. What the fuck? Uh -huh. More? Oh no. Oh no, I killed myself. <laughs> We're crawling through each other. That was frightening. Oh no! Oh jeez. Oh run! Good god, run! Come on. Oh, this is open. Thank you. 
Okay. Oh. Double kick. Okay. Yeah. You need a gun too, Moira. No, I really, really don't. Sorry, I don't do firearms. Not after what happened. Shit, I'm sorry. I forgot. Uh, maybe we can find you something else. What the night? No, I'll just be on flashlight duty or something. It's fine. All right. I think there's something shiny there, but I can't make it out. Let me hit it with the flashlight. Nice. Oh, crowbar. Blunt oh. weapon. I can do blunt weapon. Bar. She can stun certain enemies by hitting from behind. Cool. Uh -huh. What is this? <laughs> cool. Mm. Okay. That was interesting. There? You saw that, right? Yes, yeah, I did. I saw something. Okay. I could definitely feel like you could get in a rhythm with this, you know, swapping between um, Claire and, and Moira. There was an auto save. I'm wondering if I should uh, upload what we have, because I don't know how long they, this episode is. So I think that's what I'll do, actually. So I'm looking forward to playing this. Um, just thought I'd do a little bit of it and put it up and see where we, see where we go from there. So. Well, I'll definitely come back to this. I'll, I'll, I'm uh, looking forward to continuing playing this. So, until next time, I've been Matt. This has been Resident Evil Revelations 2, and we'll see you in the next one.